Hey everyone, I thought I would just make a quick tutorial to help you get started with minting NFTs on Gigitnook, which right now is the only NFT market on the Tezos network. Um, Calamint is being developed now, but for the time being, uh, Gigitnook is the only one available. So if we go to the website, Gigitnook.xyz, and apologies if I'm not pronouncing that correctly, uh, but we go to the website and we're graded by this page here, which shows us the different NFTs that have been minted as well as the number, how many there are, and how much it costs to collect them. So if you scroll down, you can see a few of them, um, and they're listed chronologically, so the new ones are listed at the top. In the top right corner, there is a sync button and a drop-down menu. And the drop-down menu is going to give us the options here to look at our objects or mint new NFTs, manage our assets, and then a little about section. So if I want to mint an NFT, I'll click on the objects there, the mint NFT section. Um, there is a prerequisite uh, that I have a Tezos wallet already set up. So in this case, I'll be using the Temple wallet to mint everything. So I have my Temple wallet set up, and I also have to have a little bit of Tezos in that wallet to act as gas. So I have a Temple wallet with about one Tezos in it. And um, as I see here, the operational cost a total of 0 0.08 Tezos to mint. So um, pretty cheap gas prices and it should definitely be covered by my amount. So I'll choose an object to begin with, so it'll help naming it. Um, I have a sketch of Alexander. Call it Alexander. So the top section there, as you could probably guess, was where I'll put the title. This is where I put a description of the object that I'm minting here. So portrait of portrait drawing of Alexander the Great. The amount of objects that will be in existence. So I want one of them. And this is interesting. This is the royalty percentage that you will receive if the object is resold. So initially the object will sell for whatever price you set at a later time. Uh, and then if the object is resold again, you'll receive a royalty based on the amount that you put here. Um, and common practice right now is about 10%. So I'll put 10% in there and we'll go ahead and upload the NFT. So I'll click the mint button there. Aha, and I'll be greeted with this page that says sync because I did not sync my wallet beforehand. And actually, if you look at the bottom of the page here, it says sync to collect, sync to mint, and sync to curate. So we'll want to hit that sync button. It'll confirm connection to my wallet, my temple wallet there. Um, again, you can use Kukai as well. Uh, and I believe there are some other options, but I, I'm using temple. It will send the confirmation. Now that we are synced up, I'll click the mint again, and it will prepare to mint the NFT. I get a pop up here asking if I want to confirm with the operation list there. Mint or option. Okay, and voila, it's as simple as that. I have minted the sketch of Alexander the Great. It is now being added to the Tezos blockchain. And it will pop, it'll appear in my assets list here. If I go to my manage assets, it does take about a minute or so to update. So okay. And there we have it. It was that quick. It is appearing in my assets now and it is object number 901. So I'll click on it and there we get a bigger view of the asset here. Um, there are a couple options. There's a info button, which fortunately it does not do anything at the time. I think this is gonna be added in later. The functionality will be added in later, but right now it does not seem to do anything. Um, it also gives you the object number. So this is number 901, as well as the issuers, Tezos address there. So I can click that and I can see 
the assets of this person's Tesla's trust there. So, see my collection there. The next thing I want to do is make this NFT available for purchase because right now it is on the blockchain and it is an NFT, but it is not curated on the marketplace. Initially, you will not see an, an option to do so until you hit the sync button. And I'll go ahead and sync my wallet. And now that I've synced the wallet to the um, page, we have the option to curate. So if I click that, I can say again how many of the objects I want to curate here. And then I can choose the price in Mutez, uh, which is um, here it listed out the exchange. So 1 million Mutez is 1 Tez. So if you want to sell the piece for 1 Tez, you would type in 1 million. If you want to sell the piece for 2 Tez, you would type in 2 million. I want to sell the piece for uh, 5 Tez. So I'll type in 5 million there. And then we'll click Curate. I'll get another pop up here asking me to confirm the transaction. And all I have to do is click the confirm button there. And we have successfully curated this NFT. And now it will be on sale for five Tezos. If we want to verify that everything has worked, I can go back to my managed assets, collect my wallet again. Here we have object 901. If I click on that, it still says it's not for sale. Um, it'll take about a minute or so for it to update on the blockchain. But after about a minute, I'll update and I should see my price reflect. So, ah, there we go. Now I can go ahead and collect this one of one portrait of Alexander the Great uh, for five Tezos. And I, if I go back to the home page, I believe it'll pop up on the homepage. There it is. There you have it. Object number 901, which we just minted with Hecate Nuck. Um, pretty simple. So a couple of steps to follow there, and you can mint your own NFT as well. But just remember to go ahead and set up your wallet beforehand and make sure that you have at least one Tezos before you try to mint anything. Um, just to make it easy to pay the gas fees. Um, if you want to get Tezos somewhere, uh, there's many places you can acquire it. I, I don't want to recommend one place in particular, uh, but I used Coinbase to get my initial Tezos. Wherever you get Tezos, you can do the same and then mint away your NFTs. But there you have it. So hope this is helpful and uh, hope you are able to mint awesome stuff. Take care.